guys. So, welcome to my first ever pre mark haul. So, in my last video, if you watched it, you will see that I went to the world's biggest um, pre mark in Birmingham. Oh my god, it was so big, honestly, so big. Um, extremely busy. But, yes, so I'm going to show you what I picked up. So, first, picked myself up a new swimming costume so yeah it's just a bright pink swimmer and it's got it's like ribbed fabric so nice and I picked this up in a size 16 and it was 12 pounds so yeah I love that um, over the top of that I found this little number so yeah this is like a long you'll see it better in the um the try on clip in a second but it's like a long sheer like coverall dress that you wear over a um swimming costume it is really gorgeous and it's like glittery yeah i love this looks so cool it's gonna look lovely on holiday so i picked this up in a size large and it was 10 pounds um next up strapless bra everybody needs a strapless bra yeah i've got quite a few um bodysuits i'm loving bodysuits these days and some of them have got like one strap so i picked up a strapless bra this i believe was six pounds and i picked it up in a 38 e so there's that one so yeah the first of many bodysuits that i picked up i love this so this is a green bodysuit and it's got one fin strap on one side so it's just like that and it's just got the clasp and clip at the bottom so yeah, this is like a ribbed effect. This is gorgeous. It does kind of slip down a little bit on one side. So what I'm going to do, I'm going to buy some um, safety pins to take on holiday and just like pin it a little bit by my bra. But yeah, this is really cute. I love it. So I picked this up in a large and that one was £5 as well. Next bodysuit. So I just picked up like a nice plain one because you can't ever go wrong with a plain black one, can you? So this is just a, a V-neck ribbed, ribbed black bodysuit with the clip at the bottom. So yeah, perfect little number for daytime or evening really. And I picked that up in a large as well, and that one was five pounds. Next bodysuit, another little one-shouldered one. So this is a, is it black or is it blue? It's black. This is black and white striped bodysuit. So that's also got one shoulder, goes over like this. And that's just got the poppers on the bottom as well. So yeah, that one's really nice. So I picked this one up in a large, and this one was four pounds. Um, with all the bodysuits, I tried them on with these shorts. Now these I did not buy today, but I did buy them in Primark. But it was about it was last month. It was probably about four weeks ago. But they're, they're such nice shorts. So they're like this. They need an iron, sorry, I got them out of the wash. Naughty me. So yeah, they're like this. And they're high-waisted and they've got a paper bag waist. So they're really cool, I love these. They may well still have them in store, I'm not sure. But I bought these in a 14 and they fit really well. And I believe, I think these were 12 pounds, I wanna say, I think. Last but not least of the clothes, I, I really wanted something like glitzy for nighttime. You know when you're on holiday, 
your drinks are flowing, you're feeling a bit burnt, you've got your glowy skin on and you just want to look a bit sassy. Love this. So it's this gold sequin play suit. How sparkly is that? So yeah, um, it's got it's got little um little bits of fabric in the boob area. It's got um it's got the straps that you can um tighten and loosen up, which are just like amazing. You need to have those straps, don't you? So yeah, it's got oh, <laughs> um, it's got a stretchy waistband. And you'll you'll see it better in the try on clip, but yeah, it's so gorgeous. I absolutely love it. So I picked this one up in a size large, and that one was twelve pounds. Yeah, that's it for the clothes that I bought myself, but I got quite a few accessories that I will show you now. So first of all, in the um in the Come to Premark with me shop, you'll see that I picked up a Harry Potter bag. I wanted a new bag, number one for the baby's change bag for the pram. But number two, I wanted something a bit bigger to take on the plane with us, you know, because to take our bottles on and nappies and everything and I found this love it incredible so yeah um I picked up the Harry Potter one and I was like oh I love it but as I was walking around I saw this and I just couldn't resist so yeah the Harry Potter one went back and the is it Mickey or Minnie? I don't really know. But this one went in my basket instead. So yeah, it's really big. It's like really big. Love it. It's got a long detachable strap. It's got a nice, a really nice size pocket underneath, which I thought would be perfect for nappies and wipes in there. And obviously this was from the Disney section and this one was £18. I thought £18 was like really good for like a flight changing bag. So yeah, and it's got this little this little cute guy here. Sweet. So yeah, I love that. I also picked up some they've got a new range out and it's um the Disney Aladdin range. And this is the Glitter Body Mist. So I did spray this in store. And it smelled so good. Let's have a look. Do, do, do. I'm trying to be really quiet because the kids are fast asleep in bed. And it's the only time I've got to film this video because we're going on holiday tomorrow. So yeah, let me spray... I wish this had smell of vision but I don't know if you can see yet see the glitz on that I thought like on holiday when you got tan and you got your nice gold shimmery play suit on and you got your glittery shimmery body mist amazing so yeah got a couple of bits of jewelry so I picked up this it's just a nice gold bangle thought that would look obviously i'm not going to wear my fitbit on holiday because who wants to count steps when they're on holiday not me so yeah i got this bangle it's pretty cool and that one was two pound picked up oh where's the other one lost an earring lost an earring picked up these really cute my sister picked these up as well they're like um like basket earrings. They're like basket wood type material. So yeah. These are really cute. Thought those would look nice. And those were three pounds. And then I picked up these little hoops. So you've got like a rose gold set. 
and you've got a silver set and a gold set. £1.50. I mean, you can't go wrong for £1.50 for three pairs of earrings, can you? Crazy. Crazy. Um, picked up some really cute little anklets. And this was a set of three. So you've got a little shell on this one here, which is pretty cute. And this middle one here is really dainty. That's probably the one that I'll wear because I like little, I mean... There's nothing dainty about me, you know. I'm quite chunky and larger than life, but I'm working on it. So I thought like a nice dainty little one would look really cute. So yeah, I'm loving those. And that was £2 for a set of three. What a bargain. And this, I'm not sure what these are. <laughs> I'm literally, I'm not sure what these are. I don't know if they're necklaces or bracelets or what I suppose I'll find out when I try to put one on but these are really cute it's a set of one two three four five six eight eight that's crazy so yeah that's either bracelets or necklaces I'm not entirely sure it doesn't say but either way they're cute so I bought them so that's all the jewellery. Picked up a couple of the um, the PS lipsticks. These are so good. I've used these a lot. And um, these are one fifty each. I mean, what a bargain. What an absolute bargain. I um, can't actually get them open right now. But yeah, these are um, gloss lipsticks. I know that matte is quite in fashion nowadays, but matte does not sit well on my lips whatsoever. It seems to just crumble and flake off. It's not good. So yeah, I got these. So they're coming on holiday with me. Also picked up a Carmex with SPF in it. You need to have SPF on your lips when you're sunbathing, for sure. Oh, that one was £2. Um, I also got the Hawaiian Tropic After Sun Butter. I absolutely love this. When you had a day in the sun and you go in and you have a nice shower and you whack this all over your body. And honestly, oh, it smells amazing. So good. And I wish you could smell it. Mmm, yum. Yeah, these, I believe, I think I've seen these in Asda as well. So, yeah. But this one was £4.90. And that's the Hawaiian Tropic After Sun Body Butter. So, next up, I picked up some brown ponytail bands. Obviously, I haven't got a lot of hair now, but the hair that I have got, if I'm sunbathing or if I'm hot, I will just pick it up and put it out of my face. So, yeah. This was a, a packet of 60 for £1. I mean, come on. 60 hair bands. That is insane. 60 hair bands, £1. Crazy. Knickers! What can I say? I've got some knickers. Hair clips. I don't know where these go, but they're always getting lost in my house. Like, literally. I've, I've had so many of these, and they just get eaten. I don't know who eats them. I don't know, but they go. So anyway, I picked up a new packet of these hair clips. It was a packet of eight for £1.50. These come in handy for when you're straightening your hair, blow drying your hair, curling your hair, whatever. Bargain. So yeah, that's all the kind of stuff that I got for me. Um, I got quite a lot of things for the children as well. So 
I'm going to show those now. Um, obviously, if you're not really wanting to see children's stuff, then it's time to sign out now. So I can't go to Primark and not pick up stuff for the babies. So, let's start with Parker. Five pairs of trainer socks, £2.30, bargain. Seven pairs of pants, 3 .50. Got him quite a few of these t-shirts. I absolutely love these t-shirts. It's like little, little vesty t-shirts. pound thirty. such a bargain. These are perfect for on holiday. He wears these all the time. Whenever we go away, these vests come on. But every time, every time we go on holiday, I like to buy him new t-shirts because they just don't last long and the stains they get on them. And for the price, it's just worth buying new so these are £1.30 each so yeah he's only four years old but I always always size up when I go to Primark because their sizing is just I don't know what what is up with their sizing but you need to size up so yeah bought him quite a few of those oh I've got another one in black Epic Superstar. That's so cute. Love it. Then I just picked them up a couple normal t-shirts. These are probably more for nighttime here. Wear these. So those were £1.30 as well. And a cool, I quickly showed him this one before he went to bed and he loves it. Dinosaur. So yeah, that one. Um, I wanted him to be like really, really comfy on the plane. We've got to leave at 2 a.m. and we're flying from Cardiff Airport and our flight's at 6 a.m. So I just wanted him to be like really comfy and snuggly. So I just got him some basic new um joggers. So yeah, just just basic basic cheap joggers, 85 to 6, four pounds. And a nice little hoodie to go with. So he's going to be as snug as a bug. Right, my baby girl. Got her a load of cheap t-shirts as well. So Danny is... Well, Danny... What's the day today? It's Wednesday night now. And Danny will be nine months old on Saturday. But I got Danny size 12 to 18 months. Because they just shrink so badly. And uh, the sizing is just rubbish. So yeah, picked up a load of these. They were all £1.30 each, and she's, oh, these are so cute. They had a load of little vests there for her as well. Can't wait to see her in those. Oh. So cute. So yeah, Danny, I, um, I got her this little dress just for, like, night time. Because she's got a lot of clothes. But I just couldn't resist this. I just thought it was so cute. So yeah, that one was £6. I also wanted Danny to be like really snuggly and warm on the plane and on the journey to the airport. So I just picked up some cheap leggings for her. So this was a packet of two. They were three quid. Like honestly, £3 for two pairs of leggings. Cannot go wrong. So you got one pair with unicorns on and just a plain pink pair. So those will look cool. And then my baby girl has got a new hoodie like her brother. That pink one. So that one was £3.50. Bibs. Do you know what? I wish I picked up some more bibs. They get stained so easily. And I hate, like, number one, I hate bibs because I just think they look scruffy. But they've got to wear them. And number two, I hate it when she's got a bib on and it's stained, so I wish I got some more. But I did get five new bibs to take with me. Then I got some nice frilly socks. She's got quite... I've brought her some bloomers from some Instagram shops. And um, they're really cute, like frilly bum bloomers. They're going to look lush. And I thought 
it'd be cute if she had some like nice little frilly socks to wear with those so she's got those and then oh my god <laughs> so cute so these are baby sunglasses so yeah these were one pound look how diddy they are i mean can't even get them on my head. So bloody cute. Yay. Yeah, she loves sunglasses. She's always trying to pull off her brothers. Every time she sees her nan, she's pulling her glasses off her head. So I saw these and I just thought, I've got to get my baby girl some sunglasses. So yeah, they are adorable, right? Love them. Yeah. So guys, that is it. I think altogether I spent I spent £168. Yeah. But then if you think about like the amount of stuff that I got, I don't think that's bad really. And I don't go into Primark all the time and spend this much money. It's just because we're going on holiday. So I let myself have a bit of a blowout. So yeah, um, I hope that you enjoyed my first ever Primark try on haul. I'm sorry if it felt a bit rushed or if I look a bit of a state, but it's currently 22.47 at night. Uh, the kids are sound asleep in bed and I've been travelling and shopping in Primark all day. I had to film this tonight because tomorrow we go on holiday and I've got no other time to do it. So literally, it was one of those, it's now or it's never. So yeah. Um, I hope you enjoyed my first ever Primark try on haul. Please give it a thumbs up if you did. Um, remember to subscribe to my channel if you want to see some more. I'm going to do some videos whilst we're on holiday and I'll upload those when we get back. And I'll try to get some pictures of some of their cute outfits on them and, and on me, of course. <laughs> Alright, thanks for watching. Bye.